Hi, I'm Patty Kim from The Green Guide for Houdini.com. If you're buying organic food, well, good for you, but you still might be exposing yourself and your family to chemicals. It all comes down to one word, plastics. Plastic is a big part of food storage and packaging, but not all plastics are created equal. Some are safer than others. So which one should we use and which one should we avoid? Well, one plastic that's controversial is the one that contains something called bisphenol A, which is believed to be a hormone disruptor. The popular water bottle manufacturer Nalgene has stopped using bisphenol A in its reusable plastic bottles. And they're not the only ones who are concerned. Canada has now labeled bisphenol A as toxic and banned it from use in baby bottles and other baby products. On the other hand, American regulators maintain that bisphenol A is safe in the amounts an average person would consume. Now, the good thing is you don't need a chemistry degree to figure out which plastics are safe and which aren't. Just look at the number inside the recycling arrows at the bottom. Safe food containers are made from number one, two, four, or number five plastics. Avoid containers with numbers three, six, and seven. Number three, something like this, is made out of vinyl or PVC, which can leach hormone disrupting phthalates and even lead into your food. You'll find the number six on things like styrofoam containers. Just avoid storing any food at all in these guys. These can leach styrene, a possible human carcinogen. And number seven's not good because that's the plastic that contains bisphenol A. Plastic baby bottles containing bisphenol A are among the most common on the market, but there are safer alternatives. Playtex and Gerber both make some bottles using safe plastic. Just look out for numbers two, four, and five. And many other kinds of safe containers are available from household name brands like Rubbermaid, Farberware, and Tupperware, just to name a few. But you still have to use your plastic products correctly. A container that's labeled microwave safe might not melt on you, but it could still emit contaminants while cooking. Instead, use ceramic or oven-proof glass dishes like Pyrex. And don't make the mistake of washing plastic containers in the dishwasher over and over. You see, the heat might actually cause some of this plastic material to break down, and that increases the risk of chemical leaching for some of these plastic products. Also, abrasive detergents can cause scratches, providing a nice little hiding place for bacteria, and you definitely don't want that. Of course, you can avoid the problem altogether by using glass, ceramic, or stainless steel containers for food storage, which you can put in the dishwasher. One more word on plastics. It's not just containers and bottles you need to be careful with. Some plastic wraps are made with PVC or polyvinyl chloride that can leach hormone disrupting phthalates into foods. That's especially true when used in the microwave. But many common wraps are PVC free, including Ziploc sandwich bags, Glad Press Seal Wrap, and Saran Cling Plus. Reusable storage containers are probably best, but when you have to use plastic wrap, Make sure it's PVC free. And don't forget, for more information about safe plastics, check out thegreenguide.com. I'm Patty Kim from The Green Guide for Houdini.com.